This is the web client module of SDL Tridian Docs. Translation and localization managers use the web client and the translation organizer module to manage and submit content for translation, such as this maintenance and care guide. Users may choose to run a translation report to understand the translation readiness of the content based on workflow status. Content that is still in draft will not be eligible to be sent for translation. Only the content that is released will be sent. Additionally, the system will check for content that has already been translated and components that have not changed. These components are already translated in Spanish and have not changed, so do not need to be sent out again. When ready to submit a translation request, the user fills out a simple screen, giving details for the job such as name and description, due date, picking a translation template, connecting to an SDL translation management system, or perhaps a file system export. Languages can be selected, and then the job is prepared. At this point, the job details could still be edited, or you can send for translation to notify the system to cycle through its preparation statuses and ultimately send the content for translation. Once in translation, we can see the individual component status has changed. We now have both an English version and also a Spanish version, showing that this is indeed in translation. Once the content has been returned from the translation management system, we have the opportunity to review the translation as an individual content component or as the entire publication. The user has the ability to publish the maintenance and care guide into any language using Tridian Docs automated publishing. In this case, we're going to generate a PDF file. And once published, we can open and view the content in this case, we have track changes turned on to show differences in the translation between versions, making it easy for the content reviewers to see the content to be reviewed. Following language review, the user can return to the repository and either accept or reject content. Again, either at an individual component level such as this and entering comments which will go directly back to the translator or via the inbox, the user can multi-select components, again to accept or reject. In this case, we'll accept the translations for these components. Trillion Docs tracks the status of each component. The approved items are translated, and the one component we rejected is back in translation. The translation job request will complete when all content is final and approved.